welcome to the Jasmine Local Hustings. Um, this, I think, is maybe our third or fourth um, Hustings event. Um, Jasmine Local, let me just very quickly explain what Jasmine Local is. It's a volunteer-run news service for the people who live and work in Jasmond. Why do we do this? Uh, we do this because we genuinely believe in local democracy. We believe it's really important that uh, our wards, our, our uh, towns, our suburbs, our cities are run properly. Um, and that's the grassroots of making sure that our, 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 our country is run properly. We're going to allow the candidates uh, a one minute opportunity and reduce themselves and explain why they, uh, you should consider voting for them. Shall we just begin uh, with Jerry at the end and moving uh, left to right? Uh, just give us a, a one minute summary of who you are, please, Jerry, uh, and why uh, we should consider voting for you. And then we'll move on after your minutes uh, up to Tom and so on. Hello, I'm Jerry Keating, the defending councillor for North, uh, North Jasmond. I hope I can offer five things. A, I'm available. I live in J uh, North Jasmond, I'm retired, I can get out and about all day long. And unless it's raining very hard, that's exactly what I do. I'm experienced, I've been a councillor for over 26 years. I know the highways and byways of the civic centre, sometimes very hard to find. I'm industrious, I work very hard indeed at everything that I do. Most importantly of all, I'm objective. I'm not guided by prejudice or emotion. I'm, I'm guided by rules, facts, procedures, and policies. And I hope you know, know where I'm going in an alphabetical sense, because finally, I'm unperturbed and indeed unflappable. The default position of people at the Civic Centre is to do as little as possible when you go to them. Right, uh, I'm Tom Woodock, um, I'm a uh, Liberal Democrat candidate in South Jesmond. Uh, I was councillor in South Jesmond for 10 years. Uh, I, again, uh, a whole host of experience to bring to the, back to the council. I was, I've been on the council for 16 years, nearly 17 years. Uh, and uh, I, I, I think as the, there is a lot of work that needs to be done uh, on the council. And again, uh, as Jerry has said, uh, Councillor Forbes' proclamation uh, of making a one-party socialist state in Newcastle is something I think we'd all like to see not happen. My name is Shella Nakvi. I live in Jesmond. I've been here for 15 years and I love this part of Newcastle. Um, I joined the Green Party because it felt like the only party that really rang true to my own ethos and values of what it means to be human and what it means to be part of a community and our relationship with each other in that community. Um, I want to do good things in Jasmond and I've met some amazing people. The Green Party are not really about dissing other parties or policies or procedures. We work with all parties. We work with all candidates and politicians. And I think we've got a great deal of potential to improve the environment, the quality of the environment, and services for the people of Jesmond. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, hello, I'm Robert. Uh, I'm a student at Newcastle University. I've been here for four years. I uh, also work as a student mentor with the university's um, Inspiring Minds program. So we go out to schools uh, for, uh, within low participation areas, raise attainment levels, uh, and encourage them to, to raise their aspirations. And that's something I've really enjoyed. Uh, I also helped set up uh, Young Greens Newcastle upon Tyne. We've campaigned to get the universities, both universities, to divest their current holdings in fossil fuel companies, which is a movement that's gathered in pace in the last few months, and that's really important. And also to tackle exploitative landlords. It's a big issue here in Desmond and Heaton and in Fenham. And Shella and I, I think, are really, we're, we're here to offer you a really ambitious um, vision for what Jesmond could become, and I think a lot more ambitious than, than the, the position we're currently in at the moment. Thank you. Evening, everybody. My name's Dan Perry. I'm the Labour candidate for North Jesmond Ward. Um, some people have said that I'm slightly unusual. I actually grew up in London, and I've chosen to settle in the North East. Um, many people go the other way. I chose to live in Newcastle because it's a fantastic place to live, it's a vibrant city, it's very friendly and I happen to think that the standard of living here is absolutely excellent and actually my school friends who come up from London to visit me they would agree with that as well. Um, I'm a chartered mechanical engineer, I've been working for nine years, uh, I work in the power industry, I think that gives me um, a, a very technical mindset which I think would fit very well for serving the community of Jesmond in terms of making improvements to the area. Uh, and, and, and getting things uh, sorted and uh, taking a sensible approach to solving problems and issues. 
Um, I lived uh, around Jesmond as a student, as a young professional in various areas. I now live on Gowan Terrace, uh, just inside uh, North Jesmond, very near to the border with South Jesmond, so I have a, uh, a view of the whole of Jesmond. Uh, and I want to be uh, a, a councillor in Jesmond because I think the area is a fantastic okay, place to live. Thank you. We'll just need to move yeah. on. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hi, everybody. My name is Kerry Alibi. Um, I'm your Labour candidate for South Jesmond. Um, I'm not a slick politician uh, with grand speeches or quick-witted replies, but I am very passionate and extremely dedicated. And every decision that I will make will be based on my principles. Um, I can't say what decisions I will make over the next four years, uh, but everyone in the room needs to know tonight um, about my sense of social justice for protecting the vulnerable, um, of defending people's rights and responsibilities. Um, my values will guide each and every decision that I make. Um, in Jasmine, I like to build a stronger community through engagement and action, um, and I like to bring families back to Jesmond. Um, in the future, I can see a nice blend of students, professionals, permanent residents and families. Um, I'd like to work with you all, um, and I think by doing that, it is achievable, and um, I'd also like you to know that I'm not just here to work hard, but I'm also here to listen. Okay, Karen. So thank you very much. Thank you. Hey there, guys. My name's Sam. I'm 21 years old, and I'm running as a Conservative candidate for South Jesmond. I study politics at Newcastle Uni, set to graduate in about six weeks. Absolutely dead excited for that. I moved here from Hull about three years ago now, absolutely fell in love with the city, fell in love with Jesmond, and I think it has an awful lot to offer students and residents alike. I'd really like to see a Newcastle where people don't feel like they have to move south immediately after they've finished the degree and create a more prosperous Newcastle and prosperous Jesmond for us all. I think the Conservative Party and the Conservative Voice has a, lot, um, has a decent means to get that to happen. Um, I'm new to council politics, really. I'm not going to pretend to know all the answers, guys, but I'm going to try my damn best. And I hope that we can learn a lot about each other this evening. Thank you. Uh, hello, everyone. I'm Matthew Sinclair. I'm the Conservative candidate for North Jesmond. Um, I live in Jesmond, and when I've been out talking to local residents and people such as Duncan Crute, the Conservative parliamentary candidate for Newcastle East, it's clear that people are very passionate about Jesmond. And really, what I want to do is get in touch with those voices and feed them through to the council the people are very keen on Jesmond and there's some sort of passionate issues that really need to be raised and simply I would want to really increase the noise of that voice and make sure people are heard. Thank you. So Fanny Jeff. Hello. <coughs> My name's Jeff Storbel. I'm the candidate for the Trade Unionist and Socialist Coalition standing in South Jesmond. I've um, lived in I lived in South Jesmond for twenty years. I currently live in Heaton. Now, you've probably never heard of us. We've been around for a couple of years, not a lot. We were formed by uh, the late Bob Crow, the um, RMT General Secretary, and the Socialist Party and a, and a coalition of other um, left-wing groups. We stand against austerity, you know, a total 100% anti-austerity um, platform <coughs> against all the cuts. We think this is a rich country. The money's in the wrong hands. You know, if we can spend $100 billion to send submarines around the world that they could all let them do if they were used, as well, we all know that, you know. We can afford to bail out bankers. We seemingly can afford to allow tax avoidance to go on massive scale. We can't afford a 10 pound an hour minimum wage and we've got zero hour contracts. You get the idea of the sort of platform that we're standing on.